Hey everyone, it's your girl Anna and I've just recorded my first YouTube food video. It will be a talk along, so with no further ado, please stay tuned and watch the video to the end. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe and give it a thumbs up. Hey guys, I will be preparing for you today some chicken card and blue. And this is my favorite meal. It is where you stuff the chicken breast with ham and cheese. We'll be using the tasty cheese, the gray sliced ham, and the CB chicken breast. Here are some seasoning that I will be using. I will not be using all, but as we go along in the video, you will see the ones that I do use. Some of these seasons are my all time favorite. And I'll list my favorite, like the spicy sweet garlic, or the ginger, or the pimento season. Here we have some garlic powder, some white pepper, some onion powder, the sauce that I was talking about, some Iberia oil, some muggy with all different flavors, some gray season, some breadcrumbs. Here we have some egg, all-purpose flour, some lactose-free milk. My son is lactose intolerant. Some shake and bake, some anchor butter, and some chiffon. Here we are at the most important part of the video. And this is where you do the cleansing. I'm now cleaning my hands, getting in between my fingers using some top water to do the trick. You should also make sure that your ear is properly sanitized. I'm now cleaning the chicken. It was pre-clean, but I like to go over and take off the excess fat. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now I'll be using some distilled vinegar by Grace. To wash the chicken I love using vinegar it cuts the rawness I recommend you use it also so now I'll be turning on the water and washing the chicken tiny with the vinegar and the running water it is always better to use running water to wash the meats Mm -hmm. So I'm taking out the excess fat, putting it one side. I will have to wash the chicken again because you can see that the water is a bit frothy. So, which means that the vinegar is still active. So I'm going to throw away this water and wash the chicken one more time with running water. Mm -hmm. Yes, I could take off my ring, but I did not. Now I'm squeezing the excess water from the chicken, putting it to drain on the cutting board. Mm -hmm. Squeezing the water from it. Mm -hmm. So now I'm about to slice it open because we don't want to cut it into half we just want to slice it open because at this point it's a bit too thick and for the method that we'll be using the rolling it has to be as flat as possible mm -hmm. so I'm cutting the other piece into the same cutting it open rather and I will be placing it the chicken on the cling wrap and using sufficient cling wrap to cover it also so that I will be able to pound it effectively mm -hmm. I pound it, I will be getting it as flat as possible or as flat as I want it 
this can also tenderize your meat so you can use this on any meat of your choice so i'm pounding 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 pounding, pounding. yes i'm pounding ensuring that the meat the chicken rather is getting as flat as possible yes although i'm pounding i'm still trying to be gentle with it so still pounding, still pounding, still pounding, and it is getting flatter, thinner, wider. Pounding, 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 pounding. I will then be seasoning the meat with some onion powder, some white pepper, some garlic powder, and some maggi and some grease seasoning so the maggi that i'll be using will be all purpose jerk and original well, chicken so i'm mixing all these seasoning together and i'm pouring and i'm pouring and i'm pouring pouring until my dead ancestor says pour no more i'm a good judge of pouring season so I'm still pouring and pouring and pouring and pouring and pouring. Mm-hmm. Yeah, don't hear the voice as yet. It's not telling me to stop it. So I'm pouring and pouring and pouring and pouring. Some all-purpose maggi seasoning. Mm-hmm. Pouring and 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 pouring. Some black pepper. Pepper lets everything taste a bit better. Mm -hmm. So, when all of these season are combined in the bowl, I'm going to mix them together. And mix and mix and mix and mix and mix and mix. Now I'm going to remove the top of the clean tin. And season the meat by sprinkling some of the seasoning on it and then pat it in. I'm only seasoning the upside because the lower side will be coated. So I'm rubbing, rubbing in the seasoning and also potting the seasoning in. I'm adding a little bit more black pepper as I think it needs a little bit more. I'm about to add the ham and i'm using two slices you can use bologna you can use turkey you can use whatever filling you want i just use the ham and the cheese mm -hmm. but try to get cheddar cheese because that will melt good so i'm trying to get it centered so when i roll the cheese won't be pushed to one side or melt away effect um too fast so i'm rolling and then i'm using the cling wrap to wrap so i'm rolling and i'm wrapping i'm rolling and i'm wrapping it's a technique after two or three times you'll get used to it and so i'm tucking the paper i'm saved by the bell that paper was so small so now I'm twining the ends and I'm sh also shaping the meat, rolling and shaping, tucking the sides, trying to get it in an oval shape. Mm -hmm. Now I'll be placing it into the refrigerator for it to cool for about 20 to 30 minutes. Now we have some eggs, some flour and some shake and bake so i just got the egg i'm going to use half a cup of flour i'm just doing two pieces of chicken breast we don't need more flour than this mm -hmm. you can use whatever flour you want you can even use counter flour now you have the egg and the shake and the bake the flour the egg and the shake and the bake so I just removed the chicken from the 
refrigerator now i'm putting it in the flour i don't want my chicken to be naked so i'm trying to get all the parts every last bit of it mm -hmm. i like naked chicken no sir my naked chicken i go after this i will be whisking the eggs so that the egg white and egg yolk will be evenly distributed. And then I will be placing the chicken into the egg. This is the tacky or the yucky part. But trust me, it is worth it. It is worth every bit. Oh wow. Look how yucky that is. Well, now I will be putting it into the shake and bake, the parmesan shake and bake. And this smells so cheesy. Wow. Make sure you get everywhere. Don't want to look chicken. Wow, this looks like it is already cooked. And it smells divine. Mm -hmm. Just look at it. Just look at it. Mm -hmm. I'm now pre eating the pots. There are two pots here one for the sauce and one to fry the chicken. Mm -hmm. And I'm adding some oil, and this is the Iberia sunflower oil, and it's a very good oil. I recommend you use it. Mm -hmm. So I'm placing the chicken, in the coated chicken, into the oil, and the oil is hot enough, not too hot. It is not overly hot because if it was, it would have started to burn the chicken already because the shake and bake coating tends to burn easily. So you have to watch this and monitor it. And now starting to make the sauce, going to cut about two cups of butter, allow it to melt. And now I'm going to add some flour slowly and gradually. I don't want it to curl, so I'm trying to go as fast as possible. Put in the caracol. Yes. And then stir and stir. Mm-hmm. To get everything, and then I'm starting to add the milk. Mm-hmm. Have to go as fast as possible. Okay, and the chicken. Mm-hmm. Adding some onion powder to the sauce. This smells so yummy. Mm, I'm already in love with this sauce. Adding some more seasons since that my ancestors are not going to say stop. So I'm just going to add a little more. Add a little more. Yes, and the chicken is ready. You see that ham in there? I'm now throwing the sauce over it. Sauce, 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 sauce. Wow, look at that. And I've served it with some breadfruit, some carrots, and some string bean. So you have come to the end of the video. Please subscribe, like, and share. Give it a big thumbs up. Yum.
it's your girl Anna and I've just recorded my first 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 first, first. Hey lovelies it's your